I regret the response from senators on the side opposite. First of all, it is absolutely amazing that there are, first of all, imputations, suggestions that things may have been misspent, that there is no accountability and no transparency. I said, and I have been misquoted, I said, this is money that was sought from the World Bank at the height of the COVID pandemic. The government of Belize, with the permission of the World Bank, spent money whilst this loan was being processed. Most of this money, I said, would be reimbursing government for expenditure that was authorized, and secondly, for increasing the awareness program. That is what I said. Senator Pitts was in this honorable Senate and debated more than one motion, supplementary expenditure. You will recall, Madam President, supplementary expenditures for COVID, specifically for COVID. Now we hear that they object to the fact that government buy vaccines. 600 and odd Belizeans have died. Probably reach 700 now, but over, well over 600. And we come here pretending to be patriots, suggesting that when we were in a worldwide pandemic, when vaccines were unavailable, when they failed to procure vaccines through diplomatic efforts, when we came to power and we secured more than half a million through our efforts, let them put on record how many they got. Now we hear criticism about vaccines being expired and being thrown away. We can make a decision. We can make a decision and have mandatory vaccination. They won't expire. Who will be the first to shout and scream if government announced that vaccinations will be mandatory in this country?